This is our 28-228 Zenith carburetor uh, rebuild series and uh, this particular carburetor happens to be a uh, 228 not a 28 and the way you can tell is the idle mixture screw on a 228 goes into the throttle body and on a uh, 28 there's a hole up here in the uh, roughly right around here in the uh, bowl cover for the idle mixture screw. Uh, the 228 is the typical um, carburetor that I work on. Okay, so I'm going to put the throttle body and the uh, float bowl together and I kind of got it started here. I'm going to put new screws in it. I usually put new screws in most of my uh, classic car rebuilds and um, the gasket which I've already sprayed with uh, silicon uh, lubricant and uh, I just have to get it lined up here screw started I put the spray lubricant on the uh, the silicon spray lubricant on on all the gaskets. Um, kind of brings them back to life, especially if they've been sitting on the shelf for a long time. And also, uh, it keeps them from sticking so much. So when you if you have to take the carburetor apart to make an adjustment or make a change or something after it's been running, um, the, the gaskets aren't uh, will get all messed up. Okay, so I got the throttle body on. So now we're on this. While we're on the subject, our kit comes with uh, two different idle mixture screws for this carburetor. There's a short one and there's a long one. Now the long one goes on the 228 series, and as I mentioned before, the 228, the idle mixture screw goes into the uh, throttle body. Now we also have a, it comes with a new spring, so we put the new spring on it. So we use the long one in the 228, the short one is for a 28. And we're going to screw it down just until it seats easily. Don't screw it too hard, it'll mess it up. We're going to turn it out one turn. Okay, that's your uh, initial setting for this particular carburetor is one turn. Now, uh, <clears throat> on a uh, 228 like this one, um, the clockwise location rotation of the idle mixture causes a uh, leaner mixture on this one. On a 28 where the idle mixture screw is on the float top, it uh, a clockwise rotation gives it a ri richer mixture. Not that that matters too much, I just turn one way or the other to get a, a, a better idle. All right, we we have machined the bottom so it's uh, nice and flat. Kit comes with a new, uh, actually two base gaskets, two different types. This one's a bigger one here. See, it's got the slot for the vacuum hole. You don't want to cover that up. You only, you're going to need that. Okay, and that's it. We're going to move on to the uh, float bowl.